Slam ball, here's the breakdown for you. You're gonna to wanna to set up with a squat stance. That means a little bit wider than shoulder width. Toes can be turned out on this. With the slam ball, it's a full body movement. It's super compound. So with this, I'm gonna show you one. Just watch as I execute. Knees are out, chest is up. You'll pick the ball up fully. You can pick it from a deadlift position or you can squat down to pick it up. When you pick it up, you wanna immediately go right into a press. So I'm taking it from the chest and then pressing it overhead. Once I get over top, I wanna to slam it straight down, okay? I'll show you these uh, sped up a little bit. Uh, however, when we get back to that setup position, knees are always out, chest is up. You'll then press and then slam it down. With the slam ball, ideally you're gonna meet it at the bottom. You can see I'm pulling myself to the ground and I'm always making sure that when I press, the ball is completely overhead. A lot of people will short the rep. You wanna press all the way out, even if you have to slow it down. When you get tired with these, totally cool, pick it up. Press, then slam. You can then set the stance, pick it up. Press, then slam. Always depends on what level you're at. Pace yourself, drive the knees out, chest up, then find your rhythm with these. That's slam ball for you.